Okay, Sword of Venus. This is a car I did not review because I couldn't get. Let's see if I can get it this time in GSD. If I still cannot get, <laughs> looks like I'm skipping the review. Eh? If I don't get it, okay. I want just a trial. Please give me a trial at least. 67 should be enough. Okay, we can review. Finally. Okay guys, I'm back in Garena Speed Drifters. Yeah, we got the trial for the gift back diamond car. Sword of Venus. So I'm gonna review this right now. So yeah, uh, all these gift back cars, uh, I'm just not gonna gacha permanent. I feel like it doesn't feel worth it, doesn't feel uh, good as uh, like the, our ISO, so might as well just review it when it's trial. This is a car I couldn't get in QQ. I, I've used so much gift back QQ, I cannot even get. <laughs> I didn't use that much, uh, but I didn't want to waste a lot of gift back, gift back uh, diamond. So okay, Sword of Venus. Every three times you use nitro or item. Base max speed plus 7.7 .7 km per hour for 9 seconds. So that is that is higher and long. And nitro power plus 7%. Okay, so modding uh, this is the faster way to mod eh? if you didn't know, you can just press here, activate infinity chip, and mod one by one, speed recommendation. 1 out of 5 2 out of 5 3 out of 5 4 out of 5 and 5 out of 5 Okay, this is the faster way to mod You don't have to press 1 by 1 in the garage But you can also see it lah eh? Modding for this car is Left Left And left Alright, let's test Sword of Venus uh, how many updates? They still don't add tutorials and it's still 10 out of 10. They did add last time but they removed it. <laughs> Sword of Venus. Let's test this out. Normal speed is... 203.8 Double boost 251.7 CWW 309.7 WCW 290.5 Next one will be activate CW 317.4 Okay And WCW 293.4 With ability eh? Ah 322.2 Okay this speed is really fast And it lasts for quite long eh? Okay another speed type of car But every 4 nitro it activates eh was it 4 nitro? I, I, uh, 3 nitro. Okay, 3 nitro or item. First test, I will play CT11. Oh, yeah, I think continuous. Never mind, just keep going. I'm not gonna try like five times.
And two minutes. Oh, one five nine nine nine. Ah, two minutes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Speed is the main thing about this car. Other than that, no other buffs. Huh? So I'll try one more. I want to try the new map. The memory wharf. They call it in English. This one. I already got my five trophies, but that's with EXA. So let's try out this map, this new map. Shouldn't done that, that's okay. This is not EXA. Safe and drift there. One, two. One thirty nine. All right, not bad. Okay, I can't really play rank in this uh, account because uh, I'm already legendary five hundred. There's barely any match, so I'm just gonna play a quick race, just a few, and then we'll conclude this. So any map will do. We'll just play. Yeah, you know what? Just. Wait, Unlimited Nitro is also in GST? Okay, I didn't know that was a thing. Huh. Well, okay, never mind about that. I'm not going to play that for now. Let's try Los Angeles. Eh, Wang. That's not the real Wang, right? <laughs> Level 55, no, I don't think so. It's in front of One thirty three. Not bad. A little heavy on uh, trying to drift. Okay, we're trying a kind of short map, but also a bit uh, difficult. Highway one. Ok, 
Okay, continuous not long eh. Doesn't have continu uh, long boost duration. Okay, can control no problem, even though it's not so strong on turning and drifting. 113, not bad. Okay, I realize, yeah, they are following exactly like uh, QQ. Weekends, if you play unlimited nitro, you gain well vouchers and not, not XP. But you can get 6000 XP. Oh, they are really following uh, QQ right now. They are really giving a lot of XP. <laughs> I need to screenshot this uh, so I can share. So yeah, they're giving free XP just like in QQ now. So you can level up very fast. That is very good. 6000. Give me that. Anyway, I'll play one more game. Okay, let's try a continuous map but not really a long map. There's a car question mark here. I'm not sure what car is that. <laughs> let's see what it is. That's weird. Oh, it's the UFO. Okay, the UFO is not... Uh, not shown there yet. Usually if your car is not really a strong drifting kind of car, you might struggle here. Let's see if this car can handle it. I had to do some extra drifts to get control. This UFO, I cannot put it. Okay, there we go. This really feels a bit like Rang, eh? Ah, yeah, I'm not strong enough <laughs> to avoid the rock unless I extra drift. Okay, 126, also not bad. Okay, so not much I can compare here. It is a gift pack diamond car, okay? Because it's a diamond car, I would say it's not worth getting because expensive, right? <laughs> gift pack diamond is like 9,000 diamonds. Is it worth spending 9,000 diamonds just for a car like this? Well, not, not really lah. Even though speed is good, but uh, yeah, you see that the records, it's not as uh, good as like, ISO and all. So, not worth it. If I compare with some cars that have this kind of characteristic, eh, maybe like. Not sure, Rainbow Stella. Rainbow Stella I didn't review because uh, it's a constellation with no trial. Eh? Because it's, it has no trial, I, I'm not gonna spend diamonds just to review this car. But yeah, looking at Rainbow Stella, it's just an early game car and increase base max speed. So yeah, something like that lah that I will say not worth getting. This car is also one of them. Also not worth getting it permanent. Maybe just for trial, okay lah, but <laughs> it's a gift pack diamond. So I say not really worth it, even though it's good in its speed. Okay, Blue Rose is a speed type of car, okay. 
So here increase 7 km per hour Every time you use 9 mini boosts You get uh, plus 5 km per hour for mini boost. So a lot of speed buff huh? right that. This one every 3 nitro Also you have increased speed and it's longer so 9 seconds and plus 7.7 .7 km per hour Nitro power also increased So if you have blue rose I think just stick with blue rose lah If your speed pass uh, buy only eh like Fairyland, okay, Fairyland is not a speed pass car in QQ. It is a, uh, it is in GSD. But even Fairyland is just yeah, increase mini boost max speed, uh, mini boost power, and okay, got mini boost duration also, so can continuous a bit. But this is a chance activate eh, and only seven seconds. What else that buffs? Okay, Dark Moon. Well, I cannot see Dark Moon here. Wait. Okay, Dark Moon. If you compare with the speed characteristic, yeah, I think this one is still faster. The, the characteristic plus 11 km per hour for 11 seconds, so it's still the best uh, speed. Eh? And, but this one takes 5 nitro to activate this characteristic. Unlike that one, only 3, three nitro. Eh? Unless you take the other characteristic, which increases only 7 km per hour for every 9 mini boost, that one maybe activates about the same time. Okay, because it's 9 mini boosts and 3 nitro, well... No, I think 3 nitro is still better than 9 mini boosts. Unless you're jumping, uh, unless you're doing continuous map, uh, that's different. Uh, but this one, uh, only 8 seconds. And nitro power is still higher though. Nitro power is higher, nitro max speed is a bit lower, and the duration is lower. So kinda... Similar characteristic, uh, I'll say lah. Kinda similar, not exactly similar characteristic with the Dark Moon's uh, one. Dark Moon's Demon Lord. This is not a speed pass in GSD and uh, QQ. This one has a lot of mini boost max speed uh, increase and mini boost power and also entang. But not so long, lah, only 7 seconds. But this is 5 drifts and also acceleration zone type of car. So yeah, this car activates every 3 nitro and item also, okay? If you're playing item, but I don't think you really need to use this in item. Kinda can, but it just increases speed only. So yeah, 3 nitro, you get the... You can activate its characteristic. And the characteristic is 9 seconds, very long. 7.7, .7, quite high. Nitro power plus 7, okay, not, not that high also, but that is all. And... Drifting is normal, turning is normal, continuous is bad actually, not not so easy to do continuous, okay? But the speed makes it okay lah. But I say, not worth it. <laughs> it doesn't have any extra characteristic like increasing your mini boost duration, it doesn't increase any end tank. The drifting and turning is normal, it's like a normal car where the characteristic just increases your speed on making your car faster. So yeah, like a basic car but the speed is fast and it, when it activates, it goes faster. That's it. Uh. Is it worth spending 9,000 diamonds on this car? No. <laughs> and I'm only. That's why I'm not gonna gacha any gift pack diamond cars. Eh. I think I sold is still better than any of the new gift pack diamond cars that are coming. I think there's like 4 gift pack diamond cars that I skipped in QQ because I cannot get it. This is one of them. And yeah, it's not worth getting it permanent okay you never know this car might suddenly come in events and you get it for free better than just gachaing <laughs> but still even if you do have this car i think you won't be using it you will still use iso s league cars they are still better okay all right so that's sort of venus gift pack diamond car not uh recommended actually <laughs> thank you guys for watching see you guys next time